All right, guys, so welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. I almost forgot the name of this game for some reason. My brain is gone. And we're returning back to the base to do the main quest, Gemini, since we have the Omega Clarence. Go up here and talk to Gaia and see what's up. Also, prior to this, we unlocked the wings of the tent. Got all 12 of the black boxes. This thing is awesome. Welcome back. It's quite fantastical. Aloy. I know your experience in Thebes was unsettling, but we have a new problem. Did something go wrong with Beta and the rig? Will we be able to transport you to Gemini? The rig is complete. The problem is Hephaestus itself. It has accelerated its proliferation throughout the Cauldron Network, increasing its power. But with your subfunctions restored, we can still succeed, right? Correct. But the net effect is that absorbing Hephaestus will take longer than previously calculated. How long? Even with Omega clearance, my current estimate is that the merge will take 35 hours. Damn! And each hour increases the risk of detection by the Zeniths. Two cores. Two overrides. What if the merge were carried out by two clones of Elizabeth Sobek, both armed with Omega Clearance? How long then? Half the time? Hephaestus would be unprepared for the simultaneous labor of two operators, in addition to obvious synergetic efficiencies. Calculating. It would reduce the merge time to approximately 4.5 hours. That's a whole lot better. Okay. Varl, it looks like we're gonna need Beta at Gemini. Do you think you can convince her? Uh, I don't know, but I'll try. What about our diversion? Are the pulse generators ready? Only a final test remains. I am confident that if fired in proximity to other cauldrons, the pulses will mask our activities at Gemini from the Zeniths. Good. As long as Aaron can operate one without shooting himself in the face. Anyway. <laughs> You'd better get down here. Beta's in bad shape. Okay. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Keep your focus, Alton, at the end. That's fine. Aloy. I tried, but it's impossible. I don't think anything will convince her to go. We don't have a choice. Good luck. Beta, you have to come with us. It's the only way. It's one mission. The most important one. We need you. Tell me why you won't go. What if they... What if they take me back, alone, in a cell again? A slave. Forever. Laurel and I will be at Gemini too. I'll protect you. As soon as we get Hephaestus, we'll come straight back here. The Zeniths aren't going to find us. You don't have to be afraid. No! You can't protect me. Nothing can protect me from them. I told you from the beginning we'll never beat them. It's hopeless. Beta. Leave me alone. You don't understand. You're right. I don't understand. We have the same genes, the same mind, the same heart. So why can't you find the strength to do what has to be done? Like Elizabeth would. Don't you think I thought about that? I don't know what piece of Elizabeth I'm missing. I don't know what you have that I don't. I look through all the data from your focus. You were raised as an outcast, shunned and isolated just like me. So what's the difference? What's my defect? <laughs> I don't mean no. <laughs> That's mean of me. But <laughs> uh, it, 
it's it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. I'll I'll stop. I won't be mean. I'm not a mean person. Beta, you don't have a defect. Beta, look, it's not a piece of Elizabeth. The difference is, I had him. Frost. He raised you, trained you, but he was never warm or loving. The day he died, the day he gave you that charm, he was going to abandon you. He wanted me to embrace the tribe. But then he gave his life for mine. He loved me in his own way. And that was enough. What did it feel like? It was like having a strength that was always there. It's still there. Even now I hear him in my head when things get bad. When it looks impossible, look deeper. And then fight like you can win. You don't have to go on the mission. We'll find another way. I'll go. You said you'd try to protect me. I believe you. But you have to promise me one thing. Yes, of course. If it goes bad, if the Zeniths find us, I don't want to be their slave again. Do you understand? Okay. Promise? I promise. I could use as much time as you can give me to study up on the merge, to make it as efficient as possible. I'll be ready when you are. I swear. Why'd you get up from one spot sitting down just to move to another spot to sit down? Come speak to me and I'll ask the others to make final preparations for the mission. Wait, is this the... Is this technically the end of the game? Because if it is, I, I might have to slow my roll here. Because there's a Hello little bit of prep Aloy. I want to be ready for. Hello, Aloy. Hey, Gaia. So, uh, me and Beta, I guess you heard what happened. Yes. I am continuously impressed by the complexity of human relationships. Despite the unpleasant circumstances that led to your quarrel, I am pleased to see you have both found an agreeable resolution. Well, two heads are better than one, right? <laughs> yes, I believe so. Are you ready to depart for Cauldron Gemini? Or we can continue our conversation. I'm not sure if you are. Um. Oh, okay, so this is going to be... I guess I should get going. As you say. Okay, so this is pretty much like a final prep kind of thing. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. Um, what do I have available as far as quests? We're going to do a little bit of side stuff for the rest of this episode. Because I have not done jack squat. I mean, I, I, I guess I kind of have, but... Um... Let's go. Let's go do. Let's go do some companion side quests. As these would technically be considered here. Uh, where we go? Right here. Yeah, we'll do Zoe stuff here real quick. 
I think we'll I think we'll probably end up doing some of that kind of prep up. I'm gonna do a little bit of um, get those control cores from the armor and saw. weapon upgrading, and then we'll so you we'll there? go from there. I'm near the Grimhorn site. On my way. <laughs> she said I'm on my way, and she Good just ran past me just to walk Let's back. Let's go get those control cores. Okay, yeah, this is what we're gonna do. We're so there's probably gonna be a couple episodes intermittently in between here. Um, probably do this side quest stuff build up our xp level up a little bit because if this is the final stuff i mean those the zeniths are going to be the hardest crap and you know we're going to have to fight them so i might as well just do a little bit of side stuff get leveled up a little get get boof and then go from there there the grimhorns and they're not alone we'll just have to be smart about this hmm. i'll follow your lead Wait, I can I can take that over. I think no, wait, it's an apex. Them. No. Okay. I don't think I can override Maybe we that. Can use them to our advantage. Machine doesn't like fire. Well, that doesn't matter. They know we're here now. No, point being subtle. no get back in the bush. I might, might be able to take this thing over. Maybe. I don't think it's going to tell me if I can, will it? Oh. Uh, okay, let us use some rocks to our advantage here. I gotta search more cauldrons to learn how to override that. Oh, so since it's Apex, it's probably not going to let me override it, is it? Yarn it. I like how this thing's trying to get past, and it's just like, Hey, let me pass, bud. He's trying so hard to get past this thing, but he can't. <laughs> oh, whatever. doesn't know. I think our battle is done. It doesn't know. <clears throat> yeah, go up there and check that out. Here. Nope. Okay, yeah, it's worse. Apex can't do anything with it. <laughs> My bad. What the hell was that? Up. Oh, there's a freaking other thing over here. Are you serious? Oh my god, there's two of them simultaneously working together. That's where the stagger rating of this game is ridiculous. And I'm out of ammo now. You mark and meet you, Bucci. Damn. You know what? I ain't critically striking you. I'm just going in for the machine gun. Oh. We did it. On. You okay? A bit That's one. Oh, they were both Apex. We should take a second control core just to be safe. Got it. 
You've got the control cores? I can take them from here. Yes. If I don't trip on a rock. Two control cores as requested. Thank you. Gaia showed me a way to scan them and take what we need to update the reboot code. I'll head back to base and get started. When I was a child, there was always enough to eat. The land gods provided for us, and every season we celebrated them. My happiest memories come from those times. Do you really think we can bring them back? We'll make it happen. Thank you, Aloy. Sky's getting dark. That's so we'll probably sort through those cores in no time. I should check up on her when I get the chance. Yeah, definitely do that. Okay, so this is what I think we need to do. Considering I'm an idiot and I have not done any of these, let's go cauldron dipping. I don't know how I'm hoping it I'm hoping they don't take as long originally as the very first one that I did, but I guarantee you that this is going to happen. This is the close one that we're going towards, right? 286 something some meters up the road yep that would be the one let's call our mount let's go up the hill man <clears throat> and we'll do that we'll do we'll do this stuff oh no look it's a dingo you in the dust? Eh, eh, eh. oh god uh, go, go, go! God, I can't see anything in here. Now we're on high alert right now. Is this actually... The entrance is up the hill. I went the wrong way. Yeah, 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 you see me, I don't care. If I can reach its core... I should get enough data to override some new machines. Oh, you guys are actually kind of tanky. Hold up. Hold up. Wasn't expecting tank. Therefore, use bigger gun. Can I get in here without? I'm gonna get hit. 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 Immunity frames. Sort of. Come in. These edges look like they'll hold uh. Come on faster, Aloy. I just hear all of them back there just chilling. You are about to enter a cauldron and won't be able to exit until you complete it. Make sure you're prepared. Oh, yeah, I think I'm good. I hope I'm good. Down it is. Table seems story. Uh, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Here we go again. Oh. Jesus. That was Ooh. fun. Now I need to find my way to the core. Shield. Oh, okay, that damaged me. Oop. Oh no. This cloud should hide me for a while. All right, so I should be able to one-shot everything in here for the most part. Looky, looky, I see you. They are dropping purple stuff, but I don't know that I really need a whole lot of this lower-end stuff. Keep Mushrooms, on the other hand, I definitely do need. Because there's going to be a boss at the end of this. 
as there usually is. Okay, so we can't go that way. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda like the design pattern on the floors. These cauldrons always reminded me of like a lot of Destiny's stuff. <clears throat> like especially with the uh, Curse of Osiris. Yeah, that's kinda cool. I liked it, I think, more than anything. You know what? I actually might be able to one-shot these guys with just this little one. I mean, we could, or we could just do this. I have to get past this shield. I'm telling you what, actually, one of the funner things, I think, to be, if they do, if they do end up having another it's game, because I have heard that the here. ending of this game that has, to be the has kind of led one to give out, like, the potential of another one already, I guess, potentially in development and or in the talks about, is if all your characters, you could actually kind of co-op some Somewhat. This will break my fall. I, th I think it would be cool. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here exactly. That's no good. Can't use the pull caster on that. What am I supposed to do here? I'm genuinely actually a little confused. Is there oh. Figured it out. I don't look around prior to me doing stupid silly stuff. So close to being able to one shot these guys with a critical. Darn it. Jumping onto that arm should be easy enough. Jump off at the right time. Wait, can I not? Okay, there we go. I was gonna say, I don't understand. I could have just jumped off right there and it would have been fine, but uh, you know, I got you, I see you. I'll have to be careful. Oh, it's the small crabs. Oh, 
there's something else over there, I think. Listen here, crab boy. I'm gonna poke your eyes out. Okay, so those things can pretty much, if I hit the crit, will be one shot on them, so. I just have to worry about all this other junk in here. There's a lot to explore in these places. How do I reach them? And this place is a whole shabba la dubla. Could try getting to that arm below. Jump. Yeah, that'd be kind of hot. What happened? I swear that happens like non-stop to me when I'm trying to do parkour in this game. I feel like some of their coding is like glitched out or something because they just will not jump. She will not jump sometimes. That was close. I should be able to hitch a ride on those metal carriers from here. There we go. This far, just have to hold on a little longer. I feel like too they took some of their inspiration for these cauldrons from like uh, I'm gonna have to get out <coughs> this thing. The soon. Matrix. Those arms can help me reach the core. Just have to get to them. Right. Made it. <laughs> One more to go. Oh, I definitely cheated that out. Hmm. Those metal carriers should get me to the core. How does one... I'm gonna have to think on this one for a second because it doesn't go any higher. Well, how do they expect you to get up high then? I mean, this is the one you have to be on, but you can't... 
You can't jump up there. Oh, there you go. Oh, hi, okay. I guess it was just a time sequence. I need to get those machine overrides. Machine stored like that. I guess it's deactivated. Ah. Oh, it's one of the like fat, grubby ones or whatever. There's the core. Now I just need to access it. Mm, here we go. <laughs> Round one. Fight. I'm not getting those overrides without a fight. Oh, that instantly got him set up. Machines got back up. Oh. Should be able to access the core now. Okay, well that was way easier than what I was expecting it to be. I was expecting it to come in here and be something different, but those guys were just trash. Looks like Hephaestus has been upgrading the cauldron security grid. Should be able to override more machines with this. doesn't even recognize some of these. Must be something I haven't seen yet. More corrupted data. If I get the right parts, I can restore it, like Gaia showed me. Where is this taking me? I should be able to override this machine. Oh, so it lets you be able test it. Scroungers now. And all the ones on the same side. At least for a while. Nice. <laughs> I'll let them fight it out. Let's watch this. Let's see what happens here. Shoot him. Do it. No, don't come for me. What are you doing? Of course, this, this thing's going to one-shot most of these guys. I got the damage up pretty high on the override system, so... Okay. Not half bad. We have ourselves a campfire over here. Well, Alright, guys. Well, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, got to do the cauldron stuff here. Do some side stuff. I think that's what we're going to do for the next few episodes until we actually get built up a little bit. I don't want to go into that uh, last mission without having some stuff stacked up a little bit, so... As always, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.